Hey guys, what is going on? I'll tell you what's going on, Susie. I've eaten here a lot, but I've never made a video before, so let's go in. So the first thing you're gonna do is get yourself some tea, some green tea. I like to put two bags in, one, two, make it a little stronger. Let's go three. Why not? And then I can refill it over and over. The hot water. Oh yeah, green tea. Mm -hmm. Next, gotta get some pickled ginger. This stuff's good, it's called gutty. I love this stuff. Cleanses the palate in between the different dishes of sushi. And last but not least, show you. And have some show you. Wasabi, good as that. Some chopsticks. Right. Here we go first. A bit of the ginger. Pickle ginger. Cleanse them out. Mm. Alright, this is my favorite one. It's called Chutoro Fatty Tuna. Yeah, it's like that. I'm gonna go ahead and just pour it on like this. There we go. Oh yeah. This is the sushi of sushi right now. Mm. It's like the steak. Oh, so nice. Tastes just like a steak. Mm. Really, the steak of the sea. I could eat like 20 of those. Alright, look at all this salmon. Marinade. Go for the biggest, freshest looking one. Mm -mm -mm. Salmon. Oh, yeah. Mm. It's marinated in something. I don't think it needs any show you. It's already got the sauce on top of it. It does need to show you. Mm. Very fishy. Mm. Oh, just got that one in time. Almost missed out. This is called uh, Inari Sushi. It's got it's just rice wrapped in like a tofu. A deep fried tofu. It's sweet. So there's no fish. There you go. It's like a bag. It's like a bag of rice. Yeah, interesting, huh? Kids like it. This one doesn't really need me to show you. Mm. Taste the sugar. Mm. It's good, very filling. And this is the cheapest dish right now. This one is 90 yen, so about 80 cents. It's a bargain. Now, oh wow, this is the jumbo sea urchin. Look at that. Uh, that's a lot of meat. Yeah, good color. It's gonna be good. Creamy. Oh, how to eat this? A little bit of wasabi. This is really the most exotic one, I think, sea urchin. Definitely, it's, a, uh, it's an acquired taste. Creamy. Mm. It's like butter. Oh. Not fishy at all. The wasabi really, really sort of gives it a nice hit. Yeah. It took me a long time to learn how to like this stuff. Yeah. All right. Now that we've got the top off, we can get, get a piece of the sushi here. All right. Here it goes. 
I think I prefer it without the rice. Either way, a peanut butter. Got the clam miso soup. Oh, look at all these clams in here. Full of clams. Oh, yeah, it's a good amount of meat. Mm. Oh, this is a thick miso. Yeah. I prefer it this way, the thicker. Yeah. Okay, I chipped on that one. Oh, my favorite. Look at this. Mmm. This one's called uh, unagi right here. It's uh, eel. Sea eel. It's good to get one. This one looks pretty meaty. Yeah, it's hot. This just came off the grill, so this one's cooked, actually. It's the only one that's cooked. And <clears throat> it's got like a teriyaki sauce on it, so it doesn't need any shoyu. Yeah, this is good stuff. Here we go. Mm. Mm. It's one of my favorites. Mm. Look at that tangy sauce. What? It doesn't it has the texture of meat. There's no way that you would know that this came from the sea. Right. Mm. Mm. Another one of my favorites. This is the crab salad. Yeah, I really like this one. It's mixed with like mayonnaise and there's some, uh, it's like coleslaw, but there's a lot of crab in it. Mostly crab meat. Mm. This one's got a bit of a salty taste, but it's good. Meaty. Crab meat. We got a lot of crab meat. Packed with crab meat. Mm. So good. Look at those salmon eggs. This one's called Ikura. I usually don't order it, but it's colorful. Got to try it. Ready? Mm. It's like little balls popping in my mouth. Very fishy. Mm -hmm. Salty. Not my favorite. Oh, look at these. This one's called Aburi Salmon. It's salmon that's just been lightly, what do you call it, seared. They take a blowtorch to the top of it and they just cook just the top of it, just lightly. But it's still raw underneath. And it's served with onions and some chives and mayonnaise. So, it's pretty unique. Dump a little show you on there. This is also one of my favorites. It's more of a salad. Let's just throw the salad all in one. Here you go. Mm. Oh, that's good. It's like a barbecue, but it's mostly raw, just the top. Man, nice, flavorful, full of flavor. This one looks pretty exotic. Wow, look at that. Squid. Squid legs. Uh, I'm not sure if I can eat this one, but it's got this stuff on it, which is like the, I forget what it's called. Like It's like a horseradish, so it spices it up. I'll add a little wasabi to it, too. This will kill the fishiness a bit. This is a hard one to get through, guys, because it's chewy. Crunchy. Oh boy. It stays in your mouth for a while. Still chewing it. 
20 minutes later, he swallows it. <laughs> All right, look at this. I like this one just because it's so Japanese looking. That's it. Look at it. Can you guess what it is? It's not fish. These are their little long onions. Yeah. It's cute, isn't it? It's got the bonita flakes on the top. Yeah. What's it taste like? It tastes like eating grass. Yeah, grassy more than onions. Yeah, like a salad. This one is called Sakura Ebi. These are little tiny shrimps. Raw shrimps. Look at that. Hundreds of them in there. That's two of them. There's one right there. It just fell out. Little shrimps. Isn't that cute? See the eye? Mm, it's cold. Oh, they're just falling off. There's hundreds of them in there. Okay, here we go. Raw mini shrimp. Not too sure about this one. I'm a chewy. Mm. Not my favorite. This one comes from Canada and it's really exotic. It's, can you guess what it's called? Pineapple fish. It's just pineapple. From Canada? Really? Mmm. Sweet. Very sweet. Mm. That's good. And let's see what the damage is. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. 16 dishes. 16 dishes. Oh my. I am stuffed. Boy, really full. So there you have it, the new Mazuko Sushi in Tokyo, Japan. This is a good one, guys. Time to rate this meal. I think I'm gonna have to give it a perfect six. That's right, six stars, six out of six. It's delicious. Now, I, I tried some different ones that I would normally wouldn't try. I know which ones I like already, but I wanted to order some that kind of looked a little more exotic, just so you guys could sort of see some of the different ones that you might not normally try. So, six out of six rating, that means I'm gonna give away some snack packs, some get some snack packs. So, I'm gonna give away three. The only thing you need to do is leave a comment down below and I will decide the winners and announce them in next week's Eric Meal Time. So thanks for watching, you guys. If you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. Look forward to reading your comments. See you next week.